Hi, today we'll be reviewing Plato's Barnyard Tales playset. This playset includes four canisters of Play-Doh, and one of the canisters turns into a Play-Doh silo. This playset also includes a basket to collect the chicken eggs, a rolling pin, and three molds, a tractor mold, a cow mold, and a little chicken mold. There are also molds inside the barnyard. They're just behind the doors. There's fruit and vegetables in those molds. My favorite part about this playset are the barnyard animals. You place the, the Play-Doh in the center of each animal and watch them grow some fur. Except with the chicken, you're helping the chicken grow a long comb and some feathers. Wow, doesn't that chicken look cool? I've never seen a chicken on the farm look like this Play-Doh chicken. Well now let's add some Play-Doh to this sheep. Let's see how much wool we can have the sheep grow. I think that the farmer will now have to shear the sheep soon. Look at all that wool. This sheep dog needs to have some fur too. Is that enough? I don't think so with this Play-Doh set. Let's add some more silver fur. It looks like the dog now has a mohawk. Now let's add some Play-Doh to the cow. I've always wanted a purple cow, so we'll add some purplish pink Play-Doh. Have you ever heard of a purple cow before? That's when you add grape juice and a vanilla ice cream together. It's delicious. But I don't think this purple cow would be that yummy. Now that our barn animals are finished, let's put the chicken on top of its nest and see if she'll lay any eggs for us. All you have to do is make some oval shaped eggs and place them in the nest. Then put the chicken on top when you spin the nest, the eggs will go down the chute and land in the basket. Now let's close up the barn doors and make some hay for the cow. The mold for the hay is underneath the silo. Essie sure loves this stuff. I have to make this for her multiple times a day. Mm. Well, eat up, Essie. We need to get you fit and up before winter time. The sheep looks hungry now. Let's see, there's a carrot mold and a corn mold, but it looks like the sheep wants to eat the plastic off of this Play-Doh set. That's not good. Why don't we use this green Play-Doh and make some grass for the sheep to eat? That's much better, isn't it? <laughs> now I'll make some corn for the chicken. There you go, mother hen. Would you like some fresh corn from the farm? The last thing I'll show you is one of these blue molds. I chose the tractor mold. What's neat about this tractor is that once you pull it out, the tractor will really stand up. I rate this toy a 5 out of 5. There's a lot of different things that you can do with this play set, and it's great for imaginary play. Please click on the screen now if you'd like to watch my Cookie Monster Steps in a Cow Pie video. Thank you!